it's amazing what can happen when you work out a lot of hexadecimal and then change a bunch of numbers around. Hey everybody, this is Impact with Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Devil Children Black Book. And, oh, yeah, Kai's looking a little stupidly strong right now. He's not the only one. Uh, cool. His attack stat is now 99, and his health is permanently stuck at 124. I just went through, literally, I don't know, the past six hours of my life hacking this game because I want us to go through this story. Which I haven't really been explaining what's going on because I was an idiot and did no research. Now I have research behind my belt and the story of this game is pretty amazing. Uh, I'll actually tell you this and I'm going the right way by the way. We, we need we need to get one more brother to talk to and he, he'll say, oh there's a tournament going on. Oh, I see my HP didn't go down. My hacking skills actually exist! I know how to hack a GB game. Yay! F the fuck? <laughs> this actually was a really hard process, I'm not explaining. But since I'm level 99, I can now, you know, have that on my party. I don't have all the guns yet, so I still can't use Sandman. Which is weird. I'll- don't worry about this. I mean... You can be mad at me all you want, but were you going to seriously wait for me to actually figure out how to fuse through the complications of this game's other language and stuff. It would have took for- oh, that guy looks interesting. I don't even know what the heck he is. I murdered him. So yeah, fights are still gonna- are gonna be piss easy now, because I pretty much one-shot everything. Oh yeah, so this place is called Marble Zone. I'm not even joking. And it's at war with three tribes. All of them, uh, owned by a brother? Of oh, some kind of, uh, I want to say Hindi gods, but I'm not exactly sure. I know that the green one's name that we talked to with the bird head, yeah, yeah uh, Kroteng the one I was calling Krotengu, uh, his name is uh, Bib Bibunare, or the Bibunara, or Vishnara, v v Vishayanara, Vijayanara. It's not Vishnu, it, it isn't at all. Azura is the blue one, which I'm pretty sure we're about to talk to right now. I don't know where all the hidden items are either. I'm still gonna be fusing things. I'm still gonna be making new teammates. I'm not gonna fuse the sheep. I'm not gonna be dumb. But we need to get later into the game for me to find better things to fuse up so we can get stronger demons, you know? And Cool can recruit anything, basically, except for things that oppose his demon family. Another fun fact uh, about Cool over here is that he's pretty much code-wise, set on our party. Oh, yeah, this is Azura. Hi, Azura, what's up? You being a bro? You're, you're mad about your brothers, too? I, I understand. I completely understand. Also, the guy we play as, Setsuna Kai. Uh, I hate calling him Setsuna. It's, I always think of a girl because it's an ambiguous name. Whatever. Setsuna here. Or whatever. He, he's got an interesting backstory. So does the other girl that we see in the beginning of the game with the griffin and... I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna explain things as they happen, or do my best to give you the rough overview of what's happening. Right now, we're just trying to get back to the tournament now that everyone's set. We can talk to the guy in the arena, and he'll be all like, Oh, time to get set to get wrecked, son. We're gonna have to fight a golem first. So that's always good. Those damage numbers are retarded. It doesn't go any higher, by the way. I, I tried pumping it to, like, 999. It, it, everything went crazy. Oh, man, my entire party was, like, bird skull things with the name 0x000, like, million scrambles. And their stats were all fucked up, and all they had was, a uh, Fio. They only had Fio as their ability. Oh, man, I don't know what the hell caused the lag spike there, but it, it did. But it's, it's, we're gonna be able to beat this game now. Now that I've pretty much cheated. I'm sorry. There's no other way. I want to show people the story. I honestly want to give you guys a show. And if that means I have to make cool unkillable, then so be it. So that stone key is going to get us to the desert world. We need that. I'm on the wrong side, aren't I? Yeah, I'm on the wrong... This guy's like, I'm on the wrong side. Well, screw you and your inf, inf data, Mr. Thing. Alright. I was explaining something about cool. Right. He is a set notion. 
even if he leaves your party, he has set numbers in the game's programming. So me making his stats forcibly like permanent like that and also making his HP permanent was actually super easy compared to how hard Hexadecimal really is and stuff. Now, fun fact, everyone else in the party has three sets of stats. I don't know which ones to change to make them permanency, and if I change certain ones, it makes all the wild ones get that strong. I found this out the fun way when I got murdered in a wild encounter because I made their stats stupidly high and had to change the numbers back. I'm writing things down on a notepad. It's perfectly fine. So let's start the tournament up, get on with round one, kill our first victim, which is just a golem. Just like that guy. I looked at every monster from the Devil Kid series also, so I... But it's like, I should have... There's no way I'm going to memorize all those names. Who has a terrible memory? Some were notable. Some I want now, but I really don't know how to fuse to get to them, and some aren't in this game. A good bit of the ones that I want, though, is ironically in Book Fire and Book Ice, so it's like... Can, it makes me want to see if there's a way to play that one, but uh, probably going to be hard if I don't cheat that one, too. I don't want to cheat. Oh, look. It's V... It's, uh, v -V, it's BB. Well, BB is the Vichy. Because Bs are Vs, so... I guess VV if you want to say it like that, but I'm pretty sure they translate it into V I V I V A H V A something. He made a mistake. He should never attack cool. It's not gonna save him. A lot of these cool boss fights are gonna go down like that unless they use something that insta kills me. I really don't know if my cheat permeates through insta death. It might, or it might just glitch and kill everything. That's why I'm afraid if something uses Megadola or some stupid attack like that. Something that'll do massive, massive damage and or, you know, insta-death. Uh, this guy's name was something with a Z and a V in it. He was, like, towards the end of the quote-unquote Pokedex, if I want to call it that. The Demon Dex. Well, I'm gonna murder him now. He looks like a building. I love how much that sheep does, too. That sheep is OP as hell. He is awesome. I'm not supposed to have him this early in the game, is the joke. So yeah, we're gonna breeze through a lot of the encounters now. So, pretty much, we're gonna have mostly story for the rest of the Let's Play. Then again, without cheating, I reached this point in... Dragon Warrior Monsters, and I did that Let's Play, and you guys didn't complain at all. I, I just hit the point of the OP wall. There's nothing they could do to stop me. Oh, yeah. He's gotta be Azura. Look at that. He's blue. He has four arms. He's pointing his finger at me with a laser. I don't like that. Like basically one-shot things. And even if my entire squad of demons die, which I'll pay to revive them, I have so much money by accident. That was a side effect. I didn't know what numbers I was changing. And I made my money go through the roof. Accidentally. Uh-oh. Dramatic music's playing. The finals. Oh, what? Hello. Yo, what the hell are you doing here? Dumb bitch. No, it's my key. You can't have it. I keep forgetting her name. Shit. Whatever this girl's name is, I'll go get it again in between episodes or something. She's uh, also looking for keys. Her story's actually slightly different if we played Red Book. It, it, oh, here's her part. Is that a fucking sea otter? Seriously, you have a sea otter on your team? Well, you don't understand. I, I have lightning sheep, which beats sea otter. Ah, there's her griffin. He silenced me. That's not gonna matter. I'm just physically attacking everything. Look, he's acting like Cool's a special attacker anyways. I mean, Cool doesn't have any good abilities at all. Look, it's not your fault, but I need that key to go exploring in the desert, please. I want to go to Desert Land. Desert Land! It's like old Mario show. So basically, we're talking about, like, what happened. Like, she was like, trying to oppose you for the key. She gets a little bit pissy. You explain that your brother's been kidnapped, and you're kind of like, I I'm on a quest to save my brother. You can't tell me shit right now. And she's explaining her story, basically, which we don't care about Red Book, so that doesn't actually matter. She'll become impor important, like, twice later. And I'm pretty sure we fight her each of those times. She's the rival. What do you expect? See, look. She has a specific demon thing. 
and then, then your keys are there. Now we're allowed to get the other key. So, uh, game, please give me the stone key. I won. I beat the Marble Zone Tournament. Give me the key. Yes! So now I have the stone key, which means I can go to the desert. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, are, are you guys gonna triple battle me? Sup, guys. And I am out of time, so this has been Impact with Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Devil Children Black Book. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment. Oh no, there looks like they're angry with me. Azura, no, you have two swords on your sprite. That's kind of angry. What are you talking about? Oh wait, I get to pick one? Well shit, I don't know. I guess I'll pick one next time?